Hey YouTube, JT here. This video was requested by a YouTube friend of mine, Wooden Chicken One. He wanted a review on a CQC7. I sent him a reply, told him the odds are sl slim that I would do a re review on that knife because, you know, it's pretty much an old knife, unless I got one of the newer ones. Uh, guys like Custom Tacticals, Cutlery Lover, they did excellent review on the knives already. But then he had, uh, he had me thinking, where do I have these knives stored? So I spent some time this evening looking for them, and I came up with these four. Okay, these first two are Benchmade Emerson collaborations from the mid-90s. Let me give a brief history on that. In 1994, president of Benchmade Knives, Les Diasis, I hope I pronounced it right, approached Emerson to manufacture the CQC6 on a larger scale. Emerson wanted to keep the CQC6 custom only, but he did license a uh, similar design of a CQC7. So this is a three and a half inch blade. They used ATS 34 steel back then. I don't know if you can make out the Benchmade uh, Bali Song butterfly logo. This is one of the first first ones. It says Emerson Spec War model CQC7. Titanium liners. G10 scales. A little while later, they came out with the longer version. I believe this one was under BM970 as the model number. And this is BM975. So this is a 4-inch blade. And then a year or two later, instead of saying Emerson Spec War, it just says Emerson Design on the back. I guess he wanted to keep those other logos proprietary. 1996, he founded... Emerson Knives Incorporated, known as EKI, based in Torrance, California. Uh, $10 million company. So this is um, from Emerson Knives, CQC7. Uh, CQC7B, I believe, not a Tonto blade. Same thing, ATS-34, G10. These scales are not as square and boxy more ergonomic has a better feel to it this is a uh, the raven i believe this is what the cq c7 was based on this one was a uh, is a stamp 2001 i think this was a uh, cm 154 i'm not sure satin finish and I really like the feel of this this handle Kevlar reinforced Kydron so Emerson nice like I said nothing but the best you go into some of these knife forums and uh, you know, more than once I've, I, I see people type in that um, Ernest Emerson and Bob Terzulu were responsible for the the popularity of uh, knives nowadays. Emerson also um, has a combat fighting system. Hybrid system, not ritual or sporting, more combative system. Free flowing, dynamic, transitioning from hand to hand techniques to weapon techniques. So, real good knives. Like I said, I can't say nothing but good things for them. Lately, lately I've been carrying a CQC8, and that one has a real good feel to it. But uh, just a little walk down memory lane. Emerson Nice. Watch your six. JTL.